For the first time in three years, the Queensland Fire and Rescue Service is recruiting new firefighters. The drive has been prompted by an increase in dangerous fires across the country. It's rewarding and action-packed, so it's no wonder being a firefighter is a highly sought-after career. But for the first time in years, job applications are open. People that uh, apply normally fit and healthy and active. Um, it's, it's, it's just a difficult process because there's a large number of people they're interested in. Successful applicants will be doing exercises like this. Last night, 150 emergency services personnel gathered for the biggest simulated exercise ever done in Townsville. There's nothing like a real-time functional exercise to actually put the, the theories into practice. The catastrophe being played out was a massive crash between a truck, several cars and a train. Guys are just about to cut the power. Once they cut the power, we'll come in and get you, OK? Which meant multiple casualties and large-scale evacuations. That was a significant undertaking as we had to stand up basically an evacuation centre which required a lot of support infrastructure in terms of, uh, in terms of sort of looking after people and moving people. It also gave crews a chance to test new technology called Total Operation Mapping or TOM. Our staff that are on scene with iPhones, iPads etc that have it on there can take photos, they can put some information into that photo and then upload it to TOM so someone else um, can see that, so we can send it down to the state. For more information on how to become a firefighter, visit the QFES website. Vivian Von Drainen, 7 News.